Hi everyone, thank you for joining me on my channel. Today is just a few days before Christmas. It is December 22nd and I've got a couple of hours. I'm gonna get on Uber Eats, DoorDash, and just realize my door is open. Hold on. Uber Eats and DoorDash and see how much money I can make. And um, you're just gonna come along with me and see what orders we can get. First order is a DoorDash. It is earned by time, nine miles, not the best, but I just decided to take it. It is um, at this place called Lucille's. Now, I know that when I'm doing an earned by time, I know I am running the risk of more than likely the customer not tipping. I do not enjoy that <laughs> one bit. I hope they do tip, uh, but it's just something that I want to try to um i know i get paid higher when it's earned by time as far as base pay and because it's a little further distance hopefully it kind of works out so and you know where it's going to take me will hopefully more than likely give me more orders so lucille's it is just up the street and i'm not even sure what time we're gonna have to pick it up but we're gonna head right there right now <laughs> the district in Green Valley, Henderson. So you can see, as you saw, there is, uh, they're decorated for Christmas. They've got Santa there too. So, and the tricky part is going to be to find parking. And of course I passed a parking spot. So, but you know what I'm going to do because I'm picking up an order. I'm going to, I'm going to let this person pass me. I'm going to turn my hazards so you can go. And I'm gonna go this way and let this person go. Um, because we're picking up an order, so I'm just gonna park here. There's tons of parking if there's, you know, whatever, an emergency. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna park here and I got my, my four ways and we're gonna go. I can't remember exactly, it was $23. Thank God the customer tipped 11. I don't know what the base pay was. Um, I'm gonna have to go back and look at the screenshot. So very, very grateful that customer tipped because um, that was nine miles away and I would not have been happy to deliver a order at a nice restaurant going nine miles and have the customer not tipping. Now I know that earned by time, I know I run the risk of picking up no tip orders and I do get that, I really do. And please do these orders, do any orders as you see fit. So I'm not telling you how to do anything, I'm just telling you what I've been doing. So uh, is it working? Yes and no, so whatever. But um, also because of the lights and it's so much traffic, I thought I might as well get try to get paid a little more because of it. So anyways, I'm here at this restaurant. Um, it's called Katsu House, and there's a net K, 
I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> I won't even try. But it's another nine miles um, going in a different direction. So hopefully I'll get an order there. And yeah, I'm kind of driving a lot of miles, but I figure if I'm going to be um, driving, trying to find other orders, I would probably be driving more than that. So at least these miles are accounted for and I'm getting paid because I'm on, I'm um, getting paid for active time. So order is probably about ready. So we're gonna go in and um, we'll see if this one's a tip too. So, but let's go inside, let's get the order. order for the um, katsu house and I'll put it here it was like nine dollars for the base pay a little more than nine dollars about four dollar tip so thirteen dollars for nine miles um, and then I didn't get anything that was worth taking the miles were even exceeding the nine miles that I was willing to take which is pretty rare for me to take something for nine miles so but glad both those customers tip I ended up with like is that too bright? Okay, so ended up with uh, $37 in like maybe, I forget the time. So probably not the best. It was more than an hour. But great if it was an hour, but it was more than an hour, kind of aging towards two hours, but maybe less. So anyways, I lost my ability to do earned by time. So I uh, went to earn by offer and then they were just no good. So I got off a DoorDash because my acceptance went from 37 to 35. It's so easy to do that. And I accepted, I don't think I took a picture, but I accepted an order, China Ogogo, going six miles um, for $11. And then I got an add-on, an extra $5, going an extra two miles. So 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, $16 for maybe eight miles, I guess, all together with everything. So... Uh, miles are a little bit high, but you know, I, sometimes you can't always do those two mile orders. So anyways, let's go to China Gogo -Go, and Twisted Sugar is going to be in that same parking and it's probably about, about two miles away. So let's head over there. Just picked up the order from China Gogo -Go, and it said more items than usual and the amount was $11 and I noticed it's a little more than $10. There might be a possibility of a higher tip. So, um, but anyways, let's go to Twisted Sugar and I'll show you where it is. Okay. So. China Ogogo is there. Okay, right there. And Twisted Sugar is right here. Oh, but I don't know the person I'm picking up for. So let's go check. were dropped off from China Gogo -Go and Twisted Sugar. Uh, Twisted uh, Sugar was both were houses, but China Gogo -Go left a message in the notes, and I'll put it right here, and I'll crop off his address, saying, "If you see this, can you please bring? Uh, can you please get more chips and extra hot sauce, or extra hot mustard?" Good to know that he put in. If you see this, it won't fault me for not bringing it. I did, however, bring it because. I happened to look at the note after I picked up the Twisted Sugar order and because I was in the parking, I just went and got it. So not that big of a deal. Of course, if I was already on the road and didn't even notice it, he just wouldn't have gotten it. So it was handed to me and I said, I did read your note about the chips and the hot mustard and he said, thank you. So will it increase my tip? I don't know, but you know, Anyways, and the Twisted Sugar was just a house drop off. Easy peasy. Wish she had put in, uh, turned her lights on because it was a little bit dark and it's been kind of rainy here. So I had to kind of, you know, 
I need to get a flashlight. That's <laughs> what I need to do. You know, use my phone. My phone flashes, which isn't the best, but it's done. So, anyways, not a very long shift. Did uh, basically, I'd say from like four till about seven, so about three hours. Uh, did two DoorDash orders. Um, on earn by time and did two uber eats orders that was a stack um, don't know really what i made but it was a ton so but it's you know i've been working all week and um you know anyway so i uh made what i made so anyways i am gonna end my video here i'm close to home so i hope that you guys if you work today or tomorrow or when you work that i hope it's really good and you make a lot of money and and Merry Christmas. And if you celebrate Hanukkah, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Holidays, whatever you may celebrate. And I hope you spend it with loved ones and you take a day of, you don't work Christmas or Christmas Eve or however it works for you because I say that and I probably will work a little bit on both those days. Not much though, just enough. Just enough to where I'm getting out a little bit. So. I am rambling, but thank you again for watching my videos and thank you so much to all my new subscribers. Let's make sure we're good here. All my new subscribers, I appreciate you all very much. If you can hit that like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and just subscribe. Subscribe. Okay. <laughs> subscribe. Sorry. So I would greatly appreciate it. Last time I like it was like 818. So yay. So anyways, have a good night. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.